All right, Brian Graham, what's up, man? Oh, not much. It's a spreading the Greco word. Love it, love it. Early uh, freestyle tournament, but man, I'm pumped for this uh, part of the season. Um, so tell me, um, you come out here, a lot of guys, a lot of the young kids out there, what's it, what's it, what do you feel like it's like for them to be introduced to Greco? Uh, some of the guys just think it's all just throws and I, you know, I, can, I don't do throws and I can't do that. I'm just like, hey guys, it's, it's wrestling. If yeah. you can wrestle, you can wrestle Greco. If you can't wrestle Greco, you can't wrestle. It's just wrestling. That's all it is. That's what it all comes down to is just wrestling. And that's why I tell the guys every single day at practice when I come to these clinics and, hey, if you like wrestling, just, just wrestle. It's easy as that. Nice. Give me, uh, what's the inside scoop on the Greco scene? You know, we got, uh... And open and stuff coming up. Uh, you know, I took a step back a little bit, just kind of focusing on my life, and yep. I'm actually just getting back into it this year. Uh -huh. So I took it completely, took a step out of it. Uh, really? and I've been following a couple guys. Uh, my guy Joe Rao. Yeah. He's, he's the Rao Plow. He's the man. Uh, I follow him a lot. He's a good dude, and he's very exciting to watch. So I what? Just, oh. just keep just. I just uh, pay attention to that guy. Nice. So why do you decide? Why do you decide? You said you want to pay, focus on some other things. Right oh, now? I, I uh, took a step back from wrestling. Mm -hmm. um, 2018. I mm -hmm. uh, got my career going. Took me a couple years to get, and that that was my my making the Olympic team after I was done uh, competing. You know, uh -huh. that was my goal when I was competing, make the Olympic team. Uh -huh. I fell short of that, but I had this opportunity come and I got it and I got in where I wanted to be uh -huh. um, got that secure and now I'm, I'm here spreading the Greco word with these young guys I got my practices going uh, you know I'm just getting back into it again so let me add after stepping away has your like mindset around wrestling changed at all about the way you think about it or anything like that oh, sometimes you just not like I didn't uh, like I'm not like break up with wrestling or anything. Yeah, yeah. But you sometimes got to fall in love with it, you know. Uh -huh. Like wrestling, what on the wrestling, wrestling side the for so long, wrestlers. you know, it was it was hard to just stop, uh -huh. just stop wrestling. And I came back in '17, made the uh, U.S. national team again, yeah. which was great. And then uh, you know, I took some time off from my my got married. Uh, so my wife and I would travel a little bit. And uh, took took a step back from coaching. Mm -hmm. I was coaching at Parker High School. Uh, took a step back from that, and then uh, now I'm I'm getting my Greco thing going, and doing my passion is Greco. Yeah. And just getting that back out there, showing these guys, these can't see guys where we used to be when I was in high school. We're meddling at Fargo High. We were winning uh, junior duels, cadet duels. You know, now we're not as tough as we used to be. I uh -huh. wanted to get us back up there. That's my nice. whole goal. All right, so match are clear and wrestling's getting ready to get going. What's your advice to some of these young kids? What would it be that want to have success like oh, you get on your level? The guys here right now are getting exposure outside of the folk style season. That's what it's all about. Mm -hmm. You know, get as much exposure. Just get on the mat once a week. You know, go to every single term you can get to, you know. Uh, like Gre go to that Greco term. You've never wrestled Greco before. Yeah. You. Just get out there and get exposure. That's all it's about. Nice. Thanks for coming out. Oh, yeah. acclimation. Clint, you got anything else for us? Uh, no, that's about it. You're the man. <laughs>